Hey everyone, how's it going? My name is Kyle. This is Kyle Plays Games. This construction simulator, and I'm going to continue on with the um, Kyle Plays Games construction company, trying to get the uh, the beach or the boardwalk thing all set up. Basically, the tourist thing all uh, going strongly and according to plan. Um, let me see what it was again that I am trying to convey across to you. Turn the campaign, the maritime tourism. That's what I've been working on. There's a couple more that are available. There's uh, three more, but I do have to do the untamed country first, which is as the bridge has been completed. We worked on the I worked on the bridge. That one took a long time, and apparently I did not follow regulation when building that. If you do not know what I'm meaning by, just look up bridge erection problems and you will see exactly what I'm talking about anyway or you've already seen it you're just going through the playlist and you're like I've already watched it but you know some people don't some people don't go in order with these things so so we got the next one is gonna be untamed country the uh, the bridge has been completed now the terrain must be prepared for the foundations of the vacation complex for this purpose a lot of soil has to be moved and the entire terrain has to be straightened oh Fun stuff there. Looks like the next one will be the hotel complex. That's going to be a fun one to do, but this is going to be more of the tedious ones. But uh, we're just going to go right through this this maritime tourism one. But before I do that, I want to take a look at my profile. Let's look at the skills. I do have one skill point, and I'm probably going to want to do. I'm probably going to want the bucket capacity. Let's go ahead and increase this. That's going to work out perfectly. All right. Go into the jobs of the campaign, go back to it, and let's go ahead and take the untamed country one, and let's go ahead and accept this contract. It's a five states construction project with an estimated earnings of a, a little over $500,000. Credits, whatever you want to call it, but you know, it's right, right there. I need to uh, remember I'm backwards on the camera. All right, let's go ahead and accept this contract, and uh, we're going to have to set up the meeting. So, let's head on back. I'm going to have to drive over there because I don't think I've unlocked that area. Let me take a look on the map to see if I've unlocked it. I have not. We are, well, we're going to be here. It's going to tell me to go backwards. Actually, I have been here. So, you know what? Why don't I just go ahead and just fast travel to it? That's going to be a whole lot easier. All right, let's go ahead and fast travel. So, as I'm getting there, be sure to like, share, and subscribe to the video, to the channel, I mean. Like, share, subscribe, like the video, and subscribe to the channel. <laughs> that went smoothly. And uh, be sure to uh, uh, leave a comment also. Let me know what you think about the video in the comments down below. Don't be too hypercritical. It's only a game, people. And um, if you are interested in watching these videos happen live, link is in the description down below for my Twitch channel. Be sure to follow along on Twitch so you don't miss out on when I go live. Let's talk to it, the tourism officer, and see what uh, job five, I mean, job three of five has to offer. My goodness, am I going to screw this whole thing up today? Probably. Every urban planner dreams of being able to develop new land and design it from the ground up. First, you have to prepare the area for the properties planned here. It's a forward-looking decision for the city to finally break new ground again. I can imagine that there will be more jobs for your company here once the site has been developed. Was that a little bit of condescending attitude from you? I mean, you really didn't leave me with much here. Alright, so I need uh, remove the debris, the rock and the waste wood. So what do we have over here? Oh, we got a huge playground here. You know, I don't see any problem here. I think we just develop here. And uh, am I going to find a body down here? Am I, is that what's going to happen? So I, can I move this stuff now? I mean, I'm I'm guessing I'm... I want to need something, but I really don't know what I need for this job. Good thing I got the trusty help of uh, the game to tell me what I need. Oh, I need a mobile crate. Well, I'll be simple. Okay, let's go up to the map here. I'm not going to get my own crane because I, I could, I could. Let's just, just get my own crane here. Let's uh, go to the uh, company vehicle fleet. 
I'll just take our flatbed crane. I think we could be able to uh, take that out. Okay, let's go ahead and enter that. Bring out old reliable that I really can't do too much. But you know what? She's been with me the whole time, so let's just go ahead and see what she's got. Probably gonna be a little bit short on the uh, crane action. Okay, so I have to remove this and move it to this specific area. I don't know why I have to be in this specific spot. But okay, can I mount right here? Yes, I can. And the great part is, is that all of these rocks and stuff have natural hooks. Right outside, right, right on, built right on the outside of them. Look at that. I mean, all I gotta do, I'm gonna get the farthest one, see if I can reach the farthest one. Probably can't. How far can I go? Definitely can't uh, do what I thought I was gonna do. But okay, here's the farthest one that I can reach. I'm sure it's gonna like strap them in, right? Yeah. Okay. Toss them over. I I don't I don't think I can reach this. It's gonna have to. <laughs> wow. Well, this will be a tedious task. Oh my goodness! This can I just? There we go. Man, you gotta love the limitations I give myself. Really, I mean, it's it's impressive on. How much I have to work in order to be able to do anything in this town. Okay, we're just gonna swing around, extend out as far as we can, make you guys a little dizzy while watching the video. There we go. I mean, if I'm gonna get dizzy doing this, you're gonna get dizzy watching it. Only fair trade. Get lined up with this one. There we go. Just gonna try to go as far as I can. Bring this one, bring it in, get the closest one. There we go. We'll go extend out again. I know you're probably saying, just buy the damn crane. Just, just buy another crane so you don't have to keep on doing this. You're making work so much harder on yourself. And the answer I gotta say to you is that I am saving money. I am saving money by doing this. I mean, like, I'm not, I don't have, I have no overhead, no other contractor. All in all, this is totally fine. I have no other vehicle expense. Can I reach this? Can I reach it? And just out of reach, just a little bit short. Nah, that's what she said. Okay, let's go to reset. Let's go to drive mode. Get about as close as we can to this here. I think we should be good. Brack it down, brace down. We can, okay. Thank you for being a little lenient on that. Can I reach the big one? Can I reach the big one? Oh, please, please. Oh, too heavy? Are you kidding me? You purposely did that. You purposely did that so I had to rent the other one. Well, instead of renting, you should just buy it, Kyle. Make the... This is why it's telling you to do this. You just get the crane. Look at that. It's got a spot for the crane, too.
you gotta put it in a specific spot, you know. The round piece goes in the square spot. Can't just get a dumpster. Really can't just get a dumpster. Not gonna be able to reach the semi. Nope. Grab both at the other ones that I've already grabbed and just maneuver them over since I'm here anyway, you know. Then fine, I'll rent the flatbed after the uh, the other crane once I get done. I don't know what happened with this arm. Why is it like this? There we go. Just slam them down. I mean, it doesn't matter if they break anyway. What is a moving earth? Round we go. There we go. Let's break my crane arm while I'm at it. Apparently I had to place it in this spot. Cause you know, we're keeping inventory. I'm gonna drive mode. I'm just gonna Actually you know what? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna get out of it and then uh we're gonna put this away. A vehicle fleet here, we're gonna go ahead and store this. That works for me. And now we need to go to the map and we need to enter the vehicle dealer. And we need a crane. We need a crane. Where is the crane? Where is that crane? Okay, I think we... Okay, we're going to need a tower crane. That's what we're going to need. Let's go ahead and rent this. Okay. Crane area. Let's go ahead and set this up. Hello. Where's this thing at? There it is. Drop it down. It legit sounds like a faucet going off, like. Right, we're right there, just get down there. There we go. Swing it on over. There you go, let's go ahead and bust it up while we're at it. Go get some high depth looks at the ground. Gonna figure out how to get that thing. What? Well, that's. Uh, Okay, all right, fine. I'm keeping the crane though. I'm going to need, I'm probably going to need a, uh, one of those earth movers, right? Vehicle fleet, let's just go ahead and get this uh, loader here. Let's go ahead and take this out. Let's see if that'll work. And if not, well then we'll go with plan C. The plan B was, get, was to rent the crane. Let's go ahead and fast travel. Back to the construction site. So just make Hape do this, you know? Like, why do I have to do all the hard work? Seems like he's just, you know, around. Can I just move this out of the way? Am I stuck? 
Am I legit stuck? No, I'm not. I'm not stuck. All right. Ah, oh, come on, come on. It's me versus Earth right now. I mean, Earth is pretty much winning right now, but we're gonna try my best. I'm gonna try my best to be able to uh, knock it out at the knees. Not exactly. Not, not, not how I saw this going. Really, not how I saw this going. Come on, bully it up, bully it up. Ah. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right. Not really what I thought was gonna. Ah, oh boy. Okay. All right. All right. Don't panic. Don't panic. Really not going the way I thought I was going to do. Really not going how I thought. There we go. There we go. No, no. It's still too heavy. It's still too heavy. Almost. Almost there. Almost. Ah, oh, no, 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 we're not taking, we're not letting momentum do this. Come on, boys up, no, 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 nothing there, okay. All right, totally doing this the wrong way, I know that, but we're committed now, we are committed. Why do you keep on rolling backwards, why? Get up, just get up. There we go, look at that, look at that. Oh, 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 no, no. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. come on, come on, come on, come on. We got it, we got this, we got this. Lift it, lift it, nope, nope, not doing it, not doing it, not doing it. Yeah, come on, push it out of there, push it out of there. I'm too afraid to end up trying to maneuver it another way. I need to, uh, well, one, I need to get rid of this sand here. I don't need this sand. Dump that. Okay. Oh, come on. Come on. I need to get out of the sand. I need to get out of this pit. Okay, we're going to try to get out of it. Get out of the pit. Get out of the pit. And I, I, okay, I'm, I'm really doing myself no favors here. Oh boy. This, this, this is not, this is not good. Not good at all. Let's reset it. Yep, we're just going to reset. Where am I at? Where am I at now? Why? Okay, any, wait, where's the camera? Where's the camera? All right, so I need to turn around behind this boulder. Skid it out, skid out, okay. We're good, we're good. I mean, uh, change the camera a little bit. There right, go. All right, don't fall into the pit. Don't fall into the pit. All right, play a little soccer with it. Why not? Oh, okay. Okay, Earth one, me nothing. Okay. Bat it up, bat it up. Okay, not exactly how I thought that was gonna go, but how did I plan that one? I didn't. I didn't really have a plan. Hard to hard to really see what's going on here. You really didn't have to do that. You didn't have to do that. I gotta reset. Okay. Um, where are we at? Where, where am I going? Okay, we are back here.
Let's turn around and go at it from this way. Man vs. Boulder, episode 3. Let's go in. Just, just ease it in. Ease it in. I can't see. Why? Okay. Take it. Take it. Just accept it. Come on. It's literally in the area. It's literally right there. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna have to, uh, vehicle fleet. We're going to put this away, store that. Okay, alright. You're not gonna get frustrated. Definitely not gonna get frustrated. Let's go to the vehicle dealer because it's probably telling me I have to get one specific thing in order to be able to move it. It's not this one. It's not this. I need to do jobs. Mobile crane. That's what I pretty much probably need. Okay, mobile crane. Mobile crane. Where is the mobile crane? Okay, mobile crane, we'll just go ahead and rent it. Okay. Fast travel to it. This is absolutely stupid. Honestly, this really is really is dumb. I literally have it in the spot it wants it it wants it at. But because it's like not being used properly, probably, that's why it's just gonna screw me over, that it's gonna tell me you have to use this and put it in the right spot. So you know what, we're just gonna do this even though I don't agree with this part. I literally use brute force in order to be able to do this. Yeah, totally wrong. Totally wrong. That's just freaking stupid. Okay, I'm just, uh, I'm just gonna get out and I'm going to unrent this. Vehicle fleet, let's go ahead and mobile crane, let's go ahead and return that. Thank you very much. Okay. Evacu- okay, now we need to excavate the area. I, mean, I thought I said evacuate the area. Uh, now, nah. oh, okay. So, I'm going to use a different excavator, because that one is going to take far too long. I, I, I hit fast travel. Well, we're here, so let's just enter in. All right, next one. Let's go get the hydraulic excavator. That that's thirty nine hundred. Okay, we'll just get this one here and rent that. Okay. Where where is it? Where did you place it at? Here. Cool. Pick it up and we'll fast travel. Okay, we'll go over here. There we go. Enter in that way. And we are not driving all the way down there. That will take over an hour just in order to drive that thing there. Trying to make these videos as quick as possible, but these bigger projects do take some time. Let's go ahead and start digging away. Hopefully at some point we'll be at that, uh, yeah, we'll get past that 0%. There we go, we're at 1, okay. This will take some time. Without question, this will take time. Oh, 
Hope you're enjoying the video so far. Hope you're enjoying the pain that I'm experiencing with this construction sim. I do enjoy playing it. I really do. But that crane thing did me wrong. I really did. This is going to be a while. I mean, if I'm legit only at 3%, wow, okay. Can I bend this arm a bit? Okay, there we go, let's go ahead and get this corner. I hated how the camera and the sides didn't end up moving randomly. Maybe, let me get out of this for a second. Uh, let me go into the my vehicle fleet. Let me get the backhoe loaded. Let me try this. Okay, let's enter this. I have to fast track again. Maybe using the the loader at first will help speed up this process. I don't know, but we're going to give this one a shot here. I need lights. Alright, we're going to barrel down. Dump it out there. I made a mistake. Really made a mistake. Okay. That's not going to work. That's not going to do me any favors. Alright, back to this. I need lights. I want to be able to see. This is like a thing that you just like turn on and off the uh, all the lights. Like, you didn't have to, like, select, like, which one you want to turn on. This will be a very long portion of the video. You're going to see all of it. I don't cut out anything, so I don't know if you want to sip just uh, get yourself something else to drink or something, I don't know, but yeah, we're gonna be here for a while just digging ourselves into a hole. More great content, you know, for the on the channel. Just uh, be sure to leave a like on the video and uh, share and subscribe. Well, I'm at seventy seven percent here. Maybe I might be able to get ten percent before I even have to move this thing. I think there's still a button I can use in order to uh, figure out just how far I, ha I need to dig, and I can't remember what button that is. Not that, not that. Not that either.
No. No. No, not that. Not that either. Really trying to figure this one out. Also, I need to rotate that camera. I can't see that crap. Maybe I need to go somewhere else. Let's go ahead back up. Let's head on out. Let's go. Actually, let's head into the pit and let's work our way out of it. Or well, maybe not. Maybe I don't do that. This is, gonna, this is gonna be a bit, bit of time. There was my machine rental for the crane and this thing. I mean, really, all I have to do is excavate the area. I think that's all I got. I think that's all that's left. Okay, we're at ten percent. Not too bad. Let's go move up a little bit here so I can be able to grab a little more earth. Since I put it all in one corner, really, one spot. Boy, I really wish I could dig a, a lot more. Seems like every three scoops, I make pro we make progress. And I see the phone line. Damn fiber optic cables. All right, I was at I was at twelve, but then that changed. To make a huge mound of dirt here. Just a huge pile of it. Well, like some of my called their their ex dating life. Just pile on the dirt here. Okay, I don't want that. I want over here. Yeah, somewhere around there. Yeah. Okay, we're not making any progress. Digging here. Move on. Move on. Can't go any further. No, I want to, I'm gonna dump it over here. Maybe because I just want to create keep one line here. I need to change that rotation. Okay. Need to change that camera over more so I can be able to see this where I'm digging. It's a huge mound of soil. Huge mound of it. Well, 
Well, we're at 15%. Oh, I don't know how long this is going to be. I don't know how long. I did not expect this to be this part of the uh, job here. Out of curiosity, what's next on this job list? I could just skip excavation task and go to uh, delivery materials. Yeah, you know, how about I skip that task? How about I just skip excavation? That's going to take so so long that you're probably, again, already bored of it. So I'm just going to skip that. And, uh, yeah, let's just... Um, okay, now we're on uh, materials delivery. All right, so that's just gonna change into something else here. We're gonna get out of here, and we're also going to uh, go to the vehicle fleet. And uh, if you guys really wanted to watch that, I, I swear that had to, that was gonna take probably about an hour to two hours just to dig up all that. I really didn't want to deal with it. If you really want to watch that whole thing, let me know in the comments, and then maybe I'll do like an extended video for another for the next one. You know this for you but aside from that we're gonna just stick with this and that's looking good right now okay that's a, looking a lot better than what it was all right deliver construction materials I need seven sewer components so I need to go to uh, what do I need to go to here not a vehicle dealer I need to get to the building material deal let's go ahead and enter into here it might be this yeah, okay, I need to... Well, I need to get all these things. So let's just go ahead and just... Well, I need to get that. So let's just go ahead and... Uh, knock this off. Wait, no, no. I'm not going to do that. If there's two things I need to do, then why am I going to... Okay, there's different materials delivery. So... Yeah, let's just put it all together in one. That's going to be the smart thing to do. Alright, go through it again. I need all of these. Okay. And check out. And let's purchase this. Let's deliver it to the construction site. Okay. It got delivered somewhere. Where did it get delivered to? Where is it? Where is my crap at? Where's it all at? Come on. You guys delivered to the wrong place? All the way over here. Oh my goodness. Okay, so it all got here. Alright, crane time. So this should be able to handle everything that I want to do. So I need to grab the sewer materials and drop that into that pipe to make sure that works properly. Last thing we want are some bad sewer lines. Let's drag this over. I'm gonna go from the. I'm gonna go to the far end, so it's like less work each time. There we go. Next one. And I am really over there. Okay, let's back it up. Next one, pick it up and we're going to drag this over.
drop it down in here. There we go. Perfect perpendicular pipe. Only five more to go. I am really glad I skipped over the excavation part. I did not have the time in order to be able to uh, do an entire video with all that excavation. I'm sure you guys didn't want to watch that anyway. I think that was a smart idea to skip over it. I just get myself dizzy with uh, where I need to put that pipe at. Uh, let's find all the other materials. Should be right around here. Only four more pieces left of the pipe. And I'm sure we'll have to deal with the other building components too. Really sorry if a lot of this is, is dark, but it just seems like the game just purposely puts me at construction at night for some reason. We're we'll probably doing some uh, work that is probably deemed uh, not ethical, you know? The fact that they're only having me doing everything. And whoa, where is this thing going? I am not trying to do this. It is swinging on, it is swinging, it keeps on swinging. Get on there. Get on that. There we go. By building on some native, you know, reserved land or something, you know, overnight, so no one can notice what's going on. Hello, why do you swing all that way? The, the controls get a little inverted after a while. I don't know if you've noticed that. I probably I have mentioned it many times before, but especially with the crane, like I'm going pressing up right now. I'm pressing. Now I have to go back. Like the up and down for the actually for the crane part actually doesn't move, doesn't change. But when I'm trying to change the direction, like traverse from one area to another, like the direction will like suddenly like switched to being like okay now you have to move the joystick to the other the complete opposite direction of what you think you're supposed to do got one more piece again like it's, it's it really I'm, I'm literally pressing the back button right now and I have to like I'm pressing up right now and yeah, it just it just feels inverted. All right, bring it in, bring it in, bring it back, bring it back, rescue it, rescue it. Do you need to go that far? Just need to go here. Okay. Next one is the uh, pallet of PVC pipes. Wherever that one is. It's only one, so I'm assuming it's the one that is farthest away from me, because why make things easy for Ami? I just swing dramatically out. So it looks a little bit more of like a daring type of thing, okay, and Eventually, we'll get close to it. Okay, there we go. Close, uh, nope, nope, not that way, not that way. That'll do. Okay, now we need to place the PVC pipe. Which is not gonna be, I wanna say it's gonna be easy, but that's gonna, it's, it's gonna be difficult for me. Again, let's go backwards, let's go backwards. Oh my gosh, come on. I'm literally pressing down, and it does not want to go down. It's 
Slowly. Slowly. There you go. Okay. Okay, which way can I go? Which way can I go? Take every single every single direction on the analog stick is the wrong direction. Bring it in. Okay, that's good. Now fill the area with soil. Oh, that's that's tremendous. Okay. I was gonna exit out of there. I'm gonna need it again. Alright, now we have to fill the area. Awesome. Um, materials delivery. Uh, I'm, t I'm just going to skip this. Yep, we're going to skip that. Okay. And watch it all get filled up. There we go. Okay, we're good. Normally I wouldn't skip it, but yeah, that would have been far too uh, long to do. Now we have to deliver the other items. We'll go back to the crane. Get back, get back, get back. Um, all right, there are the materials, okay. Somehow, maneuver the crane over to where you're supposed to go to. All right, let's do one steel beam. Bring it down, bring it down, bring it down, and... Okay, we're attached. Now let's drag the steel beam over to the area we need to go. Alright, that's one. Palette of metal elements. Okay, where is it? There it is. There it is. Okay, let's do the metal elements. I'm just going in order from what it says, really. No rhyme or reason why I'm picking these out. We went too far. Went too far. Okay. Okay, Osa would be proud of this. Two more. I'm so glad I did not give up the crane. You know, that I didn't, like, return it. Back, swing it back, swing it back. One last one. And I think it's just going to do it itself because I'm at 96%, so I don't think there's going to be much else. Where is the last one? Where's the last one? Oh, way, way back here. You kind of lose track of where everything's at when you're having to swing around constantly in this giant area. But the next one's going to be a resort that we're going to be building, like an actual like hotel. So that's going to be pretty damn cool. This is the dirty work part. Get this in there. 
There we go. Alright, did everything itself, so now I need to speak to the tourism officer. And that's all we gotta do. Um, let's just, I'm just gonna get out of this area. And I need to, one, I need to get rid of, nope, not that one. I need a vehicle fleet. Tower crane, let's go ahead and return that. I don't need it. Flatbed crane, that is stored away. I need to store away the backhoe loader. Okay. We just have the truck left. All right, where is the tourism officer? Probably all the way over, yep, yeah, okay, all right. I wonder what happens if I fall into that pit? Is, can I get out of there? I can, I can, okay, they thought ahead. I was like, oh, I'm just gonna drop, drop in there, and then you had to like reload the game. Let's complete this third one. I know so many interested people who are just waiting to buy the right property near the beach with an ocean view. Now it's just important to make a few final decisions. I envision exclusive vacation homes for luxury tourism. Oh, here, it's a, along okay. with hotel complexes for families, so that everyone can come here on vacation. Oh, so it's going to multi multi-purpose exactly building. Exactly what I imagined. Okay, all right. That's even cooler. I'll, I'll, I will say. All right. Well, we got development area completed. That's really technically states one of two, but I'll take it. Didn't really gain. I don't think we gained any type of like um, skills from that one because I did skip ahead on a couple of them. If I would have done the whole thing, I probably would have earned a skill. But I didn't, and you know what? This video has gone on long enough. I'm just going to go back. I'm just going to fast travel back to the company headquarters and call it a day. Okay. I'm just going to leave my lights on because I'll be back to it in no time. And let's go ahead and display my name there. Perfect. All right. Well. That concludes another uh, Construction Sim video of Kyle Plays Games Construction Company. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm looking forward to doing the next one because we get to develop on that land with that uh, hotel or suburban, whatever, you know, luxury homes, whatever it is. But we get to build a big old building, and I am definitely looking forward to that. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like on the video, share the video, and do not forget to subscribe to the channel to help support the channel out. Also, you get notified for when I come out with the next video of Construction Sim and also of all, all the other uh, game series that I put on the channel. So you, do not get so you will not miss out, and I hope you do not get disappointed on the content. Um, but also leave a comment also. Let me know what you thought about the video in the comments down below. Um, if you would have liked to see me excavate all that soil and then also put, put in all the other soil, I mean, like, that would have probably made for a two-hour long video, so I'm just kind of thinking about time-wise. That's why I decided to skip ahead a little bit, but again, you got to see the whole thing anyway. And, of course, if you'd like to watch any of these videos happen live, link is in the description down below for my Twitch channel. Be sure to follow along on Twitch so you do not miss out on when I go live. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video.